Who was Anne Frank? We're back. Chapter four, occupied. Check out that picture. What is this? What kind of flag? The Netherlands was now an occupied country. That meant the Germans were in control. Up went Nazi flags. Right away, life began to change for everyone. Most of all, for the Jews. Now, all the Jews, even children like Anne and her sister, had to register with the Germans. Nobody else had to do this. But the Germans wanted to keep track of all the Jews. They wanted to know who each person was and where he or she lived. Jews had to turn over nearly all of their money to the Nazis. Their businesses were taken away. Otto handed over his handed his over to two good friends who weren't Jewish and who already worked there. If Jews worked in companies owned by non-Jews, their jobs were taken away. Books by Jewish authors were banned, so were movies made by Jews. Jewish people couldn't even attend movies. That must have upset Anne a great deal. Her parents did all they could. They rented movies and projectors to show at home. Anne and her friend Jackie made tickets and led people. Anne's mother provided refreshments. There were random attacks against Jewish people. One Saturday afternoon, a group led by German soldiers beat up and arrested 400 Jewish men. Otto Frank was lucky enough to stay out of harm's way. The arrested men were sent to concentration camps. Look, sent to concentration camps. The arrested men were sent to concentration camps. Only one of the men ever returned to the city. The Dutch people were outraged. They staged a strike. At 10.30 one morning in February, work stopped all over the Netherlands. Street cars came to a halt. Shops closed. Restaurants didn't serve. Factories shut down. It was a countrywide strike. In this way, the Dutch told Hitler what they thought of him. His treatment of the Jews was wrong, unfair, and not human. Dutch on strike! That means they stopped all their work. The city just stopped. Did this stop the Germans? No. no. By now, there was no way for Anne's mother and father to keep what was happening from their children. Signs went up on park benches. Forbidden to Jews. So could they sit on the bench? No. no. The Jews of Amsterdam were no longer allowed in libraries, museums, concert halls, restaurants, or even the zoo. That summer, Jews were forbidden to use public benches, beaches, and pools. They could not visit public parks or hotels. How awful for everyone, but most of all, children like Anne. <laughs> Here it was summer, and there was nowhere they could go for fun. Each time something was taken away from them, Jewish people hoped that nothing worse would happen. And indeed, there were still happy times for the Franks. Anne spent part of her vacation with her friends, staying family, in the country. In the country, it was a while at Sam's, it was while she was at Sam's house that Anne first started noticing boys. There was also a wedding. Everyone in the Frank family was very close to the Dutch woman. Meek, Mike. Mike worked at the Pecton Company. She was not Jewish, nor was her new husband, Jan Geis. But Mike, but change the name, I'm sorry, had known and respected Otto Frank for many years. Mike was especially close to Anne. Anne did not know it then, but soon this young couple was going to play a very important role in her life. Okay, let's review. Who took over the Netherlands? The Nazis, the Germans took over. Could they read books by Jewish people? No. 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 Could they go to museums? No. no. To who had to register with the Germans? The Nazis. No. The Nazis. Look up here. The uh, Jewish. Jewish. The Jewish people. Yes. Did other people have to register? No. No, just the Jewish people. And they had to give over their 
Money. Money. Did they get to keep their jobs? Did they get to keep their businesses? No. 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 They got all separated. Over 400 Jewish men were sent away to concentration camps. How many came back? One. One. Good job. The Dutch are on strike. What does that mean? That all the businesses closed. closed. Nothing was running because they said that they wanted to show Hitler that they thought he was good or bad. bad. Was he being mean or nice to the Jewish people? Mean. So this was their way to say, stop it. We don't like you. We don't want you. Did that change anything? Nope. Nope. Were they allowed to sit on park benches? Nope. No, it said forbidden to Jews. But meet my, whoever she is, she and Jan got married. And that was really important. Do we know why? No. No, we're going to have to read the next chapter. Thanks, guys. Bye.